The following is a Fox 30 UPN2 Community Spotlight. From uh, my personal standpoint, that the steel medium is the most fluid and most responsive to the type of images that I enjoy working in. It's an intuitive process, but uh, it, it has always, it's worked for me and I, I can't imagine another working style for me as a, uh, as a sculptor. When I'm working on a particular piece, since I do respond to the material at hand, uh, sometimes it doesn't go in the direction that I had initially planned it to. And since I'm what you consider a direct metal artist, I just go ahead and allow the material or the medium to kind of dictate kind of the direction that the form will go. Just the nature of transforming uh, what normal people would consider just a piece of rebar, a flat piece of uh, plate, uh, a piece of pipe uh, is, to me, is the, the challenge of recreating that material in a different form. And that it's really a fun process for me. Uh, as a sculptor, I, I see endless possibilities in, you know, in the world around me and I, I just respond to visual stimuli that I have and I distill that down and hopefully as a mature artist I can kind of continue to respond in that fashion because I think that is what uh, the growth of an artist is all about. Since my artwork is such a, uh, a private enterprise to me, I don't go about it with the idea that I'm going to create something that people are really going to like. That's not the direction I go as a, uh, as a sculptor. I would say that my artwork is a, a selfish type of artwork because I'm really out to please myself. It is a private endeavor and it's just kind of like your memoirs. I mean, sometimes it's okay if people read it, other times it doesn't matter if people read it at all. You've done it for your own satisfaction. That is what is important to me as an artist. Paradise Pip Printing, Sierra Nevada Brewing, and R.W. Knudsen proudly support the creative spirit.